scary videos, filmed by Dashcam, volume 3. Number 5. This biker didn't wake up in Tucson, Arizona thinking he'd almost lose his life today. He's not tailgating the car in front of him and appears to be driving steadily, but note the driver in his rearview mirror. This is a no passing zone. The impatient driver pulls out ahead cutting into a turning lane. The biker, furious with the man's carelessness, speeds up to confront him. Pull your window down! You fat Hey! You wanna mess around with people's lives? Go ahead! The confrontation escalates. I'm not sure who is in the right here, but driving aggressively around motorcycles is never a good idea. Number 4 This terrifying attempted robbery occurred in Reading, Pennsylvania. Give me all your money, man. Man, I don't have to. Give me everything you got. Give me that. Now. All right. All right. I need it now. All right. I can make it the easy way. I can make this the hard way, man. Everything I got, man. Keep, keep your hand where I can see him. I just started. What, what I just started. What else you got? I just started. Let me see your wallet. Let me see your... You, I, don't, I don't have anything in my wallet. We can do this the hard way, or we can do this the easy way, man. Let me see your wallet, and let me see your phone. Uh -oh. I need it all right now, if you don't want to die, man. Okay. Okay. Give it off to me now. Okay. Okay. As the poor taxi driver fumbles for his wallet, notice the flashing lights behind him. I'm not gonna hurt you. Just give me everything I, you got. I, I, sir, I don't have anything in my wallet. I don't give carry me your it. wallet and your phone. I need mean, your wallet. Who's cut? They both see the police at once. Get out. Get out. The suspect's plan is foiled. Oh my god! Oh my god! I can't believe it! He had a gun. He had a gun in my head. He had a gun in my head. He had a gun in my head. The driver is in tears, understandably shaken up from the incident. Oh my god! I'm gonna have a heart attack. He's got my wallet. He's got my wallet and my money. According to WFMZ News, this is the third time this taxi driver has been robbed in this way while on the job. Number 3 This incident occurred on Downey Boulevard in Los Angeles, California in 2016. Although it's been six years since this took place, CBS News reports that road rage incidents are on the rise in Los Angeles. They've risen a stunning 32.7% in the past year, with 459 incidents reported. You're about to witness a prime example. We can't really tell what's going on here, but we can assure there's a conflict between the biker and the driver. The biker starts to retreat, but then returns to argue his point. The driver relents and winds down his window. The biker refuses to go away. They both appear relatively calm in all of this, which makes what happens next all the more shocking. After smashing the driver's rear window, the biker heads back to his ride. But the driver isn't going to let him off that easily. But the biker is gone in a flash, lucky for him because he would have been sledgehammered. Number 2 This next encounter occurred in North Hollywood, California, yet another road rage classic in Los Angeles. The dashcam driver sits at an intersection minding his own business. In fact, he's rocking out to Red Hot Chili Peppers, which I can't play here. 
At this point, he's completely unaware that his day is about to get a whole lot weirder, and not in a good way. As he waits for the light to change, a Chevy Equinox pulls up alongside him in the turning lane. It soon becomes clear that the driver is trying to cut off normal traffic. When the light changes, he speeds past to get around him, cutting him off instead. Apparently, the driver of the Chevy does not like that. For a while, the dashcam driver is safe from Chevy driver's rage. He continues steadily on without incident. Until the Chevy driver speeds up to pull around him and cut him off again. He slows down in front of the dashcam driver and straddles the lane so he cannot pass. Dashcam driver keeps his distance but then tries to switch lanes. This time the Chevy driver pulls to a complete stop in front of him, blocking him in. The driver gets out of his vehicle, clearly with the intent to start something. But then, he sees the guy's dash cam, and for once, common sense prevails. He retreats with his tail between his legs. Number one. This video's exact location is unknown, but judging by the Cyrillic script on passing cars, we can place it in a Russian-speaking country. The vehicle with the dash cam pulls out behind this tanker truck. They will soon regret it. As the car travels down a long stretch of road, the passengers inside chat about everything and nothing. The driver keeps a safe distance behind the tanker truck, but before long, he catches up, and that distance will somehow become unsafe. The National Safety Council recommends a minimum three-second following distance. This is about three cars' lengths between you and the car in front of you. As you can see at this point, the dash cam driver is maintaining that following distance, but he will close the gap as they arrive to the railroad track up ahead. This is natural as all the vehicles slow at once to carefully cross the tracks. But as the red tanker slows, something falls from his vehicle. It looks like a heavy lid and it barely misses oncoming traffic. Realizing what happened, the driver of the tanker quickly hops out of his vehicle, forgetting to put it in park. The resulting impact smashes the windshield to pieces. Both drivers get out of their vehicles to assess the damage. Luckily, there is no rage on either end. Each of the drivers keep it together and we can assume they exchange insurance and other pertinent details, though I still can't imagine being in that vehicle when the windshield smashed. This has been Documented Reality. Thank you to these individuals for allowing me to share their story. Watch the last episode here.